It looks like something out of a sci-fi movie, complete with the club on its tail. But it once was real in Rome, New Mexico, 73 million years ago. You can now see the dinosaur only in Albuquerque because it's the only one that's ever been found. Today, the skull was unveiled at the New Mexico Museum of Natural History and Science. I'm walking across this rather nondescript terrain, which you would not normally look for fossils in, and there it was. It was a big discovery for paleontologist Dr. Robert Sullivan, who was working in the Beastie Wilderness in the San Juan Basin just south of Farmington in 2011. Today, his find was made public. It's called an ankylosaur, which is a, uh, kind of looks vaguely like an alligator, an armored alligator. And while there were all kinds of ankylosaurs during the Cretaceous period, Sullivan had discovered the skull and part of the neck of a new one, now called the Zia Pelta. And this one here in particular, based on uh, traits of its skull, was a new species. The condition of the dinosaur's bones is also a unique find. It's very rare that you find something like this that's so well preserved and missing very little of the, of the skull. The rest of the dinosaur's body is still missing, but paleontologists were still able to create this sketch. So how do they know what the rest of the dinosaur looked like? The reconstruction of it, that's based on what we know of other types of ankylosaurs, which are close relatives to this particular uh, dinosaur. The once heavily armored dinosaur is now on display. That's just cool. Paleontologists have spent decades digging in the San Juan Basin and often find dinosaurs there. But say finding a new species is extremely rare.